Hey everybody, I'm Junior Pierce, uh, owner of Elite Fiberglass Works here in Brandon, Mississippi. Um, just to give you a little rundown, man, I've read a lot of books and, and done a lot of reading and uh, just articles and, you know, watched a lot of videos about business and building business and making money and, you know, and everything I look, I, I read, you know, such as Grant Cardone, man, it's great. Gets me pumped up, gets me motivated, whatnot. Uh, but man, he's already got a lot of money and makes a lot of money. You know, it's hard. I sat back and thought about it one day and it's, it's easy to make a million if you got, you know, two million or, you know, it'd be easier. But um, what we have here is uh, actually as of now, right now I got seven employees uh, and then myself. Um, this started in my garage. This was a, this business started uh, it, it went along for about three years of just talking about it, whatnot. I had a guy, a friend of mine, uh, Shannon Denson, uh, put it in my ear. Man, I kind of blew it off back and forth. And uh, long story short, one day a friend of mine reached out to me. Uh, COVID hit, you know, uh, things just kind of, I was building fishing rods and baits and painting baits and whatnot. Um, he had a scratch on his boat. He had his boat sold in a fiberglass shop here in town. Couldn't get to it to fix it. And the guy that was buying it wanted that spot fixed. Long story short, he asked me if I would tackle it. He ordered all the stuff. Man, I put it in my garage. Uh, tinkered with it. Got it taken care of. Took some pictures of it. Posted on social media. And it blew up. Uh, I'm extremely humbled to look around now and know that all of this really just began uh from nothing i mean this is a true and not that it's riches by any means i mean i'm not rich i'm not getting rich but we are paying our bills and while uh while just in enjoying it you know um i started this youtube channel uh just to show you the good the bad and the ugly of business i mean there's um i'm gonna lay it all out there it's gonna be honest open uh, if there's any questions, I'd be more than happy to answer you. Not that I'm a guru by any means, but, uh, you know, this is real life. This is, uh, you know, shit happens. Uh, I'm not, I'm not actually videoing this on my iPhone. I'm not going to do a lot of editing. There's going to be some cuss words said. There's going to be some hiccups. There's going to be a lot of uhs and um. Man, uh, you know, there's going to be a lot of that. I mean, it ain't going to be perfect. It's not going to be set up like a commercial. I mean, like I said, this is going to be true, real-life stories going on. But uh, a friend of mine, Stephen Renfro, uh, after my business kind of blew up in my garage there, uh, Stephen actually rents a, another shop uh, out way, I say way out, it's probably 25 minutes from here. Um he was uh, kind enough to rent me one end of it. And man, business started picking up, picking up. Uh, I was turning around, you know, turning boats in and out pretty quick. Hired a few people. And uh, before I knew it, I was taking more of his room in his shop than I had anticipated, than we had agreed upon. Uh, so there's a local boat shop next door called RJ's Outboards. They're a boat, they're a Skeeter dealer, a G3s. Uh, man, they've got a ton of stuff over there. But uh the owner there asked me to bring some business cards by so uh one day i just dropped some business cards off i asked him if he knew of a shop locally that i could rent and uh he pointed over here next door to this one um man i came over here and looked at it i made a phone call i moved in and less than two weeks after that um business has continuously picked up um we're turning out boats as fast as we can boats are coming in faster than we're turning them out uh, we do everything from carpet to trailer maintenance recovering bunks we do some fiberglass work gel coat work insurance claims uh man we do welding i mean we put a stereo in an f-150 i got a speaker box right here that i've got to fiberglass up that's uh it's got it's not airtight uh we've got to actually expand on it a little bit it goes in the boat um this boat here is a Scout Center console. Uh, customer picked it up. He bought it, brought it straight here. He didn't have it two weeks before we we brought it here. Uh, we're doing some repairs on it. This is a friend of mine's Ranger, uh, Randall Malone. We're doing some work to it. He got carpet, he got cutting. I'd have to look at the paper to tell you everything he got. Um, 
And another thing we do is boat restoration. Really, I mean, you know, the boats now are hundred thousand uh, dollars. Not everybody can just drop a hundred grand to go out here and fish for five hundred or three hundred. You know, so we're doing a lot of boats. You know, such as this Stratus. This guy, uh, you know, I don't know his whole story, but you know, it, he wanted it cut, buffed, carpet. We recovered the bunks. Um, and he's got a new trailer jack, new strap on the trailer, uh, water pressure gauge. We're gonna build a flipping deck con uh, compartment that goes is gonna go here. Um, man, that's it. I'm gonna do these videos. Uh, I'm gonna try to do two a week. I'm gonna try to keep them 10, 12 minutes long, just to let y'all know what's going on. You know, um, look, uh, here's outside. Well, to be honest, all right. So. Uh, Bought both of these lifts off of uh, Facebook Marketplace. Uh, had had a lot of tools in that cart right there. You know, we got some. This is my parts washer from when I was racing cars. My dad. That was my dad's. We used to race dirt track cars. Uh, we had some stuff, you know, tool wise and all. Uh, back there, my buddy's a Mac tool guy. Bought that box. It's got some miscellaneous stuff. Uh, we got these lights put up, man. I had a buddy of mine, Justin Bond. Uh, they own a uh, supply company for uh, electrical supplies. They swapped these lights out. I, he gave me six of them. I put uh, LED lights in them. I don't even know what they're called, but they took the ballast out, wired them in direct. I got six of those in there. That was something we did to the building. Out here, we got a boat that's got some brake work. We did some trailer work, trailer maintenance. This one's got trailer maintenance we installed some led nav lights uh you got a full detail this one here was a uh this is actually an old mark rose boat had some scratches on the bottom we fixed up this one came in today it's going to get a full cut and buff all of the black it had a wrap uh he's getting ready to sell it once it cleaned up shined up all the scratches gone that he can get gone uh actually had this carport put up today i've got two guys that do nothing but detailing um gonna get them fixed up got this put up for them today uh we're gonna put some lights in there got a cabinet built uh, or not a built we bought it 60 something bucks at lowe's but got all their cleaning supplies i'm gonna put a light in there or a couple of those high bay lights leds uh get them fixed up so they'll be out of the rain you know boats uh we detail them or they detail them and then it'll frost that night or something and at least they'll be covered uh we got this uh asphalt laid down man it wasn't here when i got here uh it was just kind of a muddy gravelly mess like like this when i moved in here so uh worked out a trade there got us a fence put up back here you can see rj's in the background man they've got a lot more going on than i do but um man we've come a long way in a short amount of time i think i actually got my tax id back in june i think it is my wife i know for sure but uh man we've just grown a lot i got all of these back here are boats I have to work on right now. Uh, he's getting some sea deck like flooring. This one's getting, and I don't even know what all. This is an insurance job. Looks like it jumped a speed bump. Uh, this boat here is a uh, buddy French. He's getting some, I mean, he's getting cut and buff carpet, a lot of installs. Same thing here, basically. Uh, this is a uh, Ramey Harold's son's boats getting carpet put in it. Man, uh, so this building has been a uh, pesticide place. It's been a mechanic shop. It was a, a upholstery shop. People still come here looking to get upholstery done. Uh, and now it's a fiberglass shop. Um, man, I, I just, I never would have believed that this would blow up to the amount that it has. I mean, there's 20 something boats here right now. Um, you know, we've been in business, what, a little over six months. I mean, I can't even do the math that quick in my head, but I mean, hell I, you know and i'm not a businessman i'm a worker uh i'm a guy that can just kind of look at stuff and work on it a little bit and make things happen i mean uh i'm learning the business side of being trying to keep customers happy employees happy keep boats turning work coming in work going out running a facebook page now a youtube um trying to manage money and i'll be honest with you that has been my biggest Ooh, my whole life has been a struggle managing money. But look, y'all, uh, if you will, subscribe. You know, share this with your buddies, whatnot. Um, man, it's going to be a fun ride. It has been so far, and I'm glad to be able to share it with y'all. Uh, y'all have a great day, and look for another video coming out soon, okay? Uh, 
I appreciate y'all taking the time to watch us. Thank you.